She just sat on the floor on a ball. On the floor? Like, looking like she was gonna cry, and she told me I had to go get some of that. Oh my gosh. No. right now on Thursday and it is 10 20 right now I got this and I wanted to unbox this with you guys so I'm guessing this is the one that I just ordered recently let's see what's in it Vista print. Wow. I'm trying to grab two. And the card is very thick. I can't even. All right. It's pretty cool. Nice, huh? And look at the back of it. Yes, that's right. Complimentary consultation. If you're ready, I am ready. Let's do this. I'm here to help you, to support you, to guide you, and to motivate you. And if you have any questions, please give me a call. That's my number right there. All right, you guys, I'll see you in a little bit. I'm gonna go get started my day. Good morning, you guys. It is December 14th, Thursday, and right now it's 11 o'clock a.m. And I just weigh myself and really what oh my gosh 114.2 pounds that is crazy and we're gonna see what is my body fat percentage today all right let's do that right now I'm ready. Are you ready? <laughs> Let's do this. Take a look. 18.5% body fat in 19.3 BMI. So it went down from yesterday. It was 19.5% body fat. Today is 18.5% body fat. 1% difference. That is huge in one day. Huge, huge, huge. Usually you get that in like a week. <laughs> Usually I do get that in like a week. So that is awesome, awesome. All right, so I'm gonna keep you posted with this every day I love doing this uh, at least while we're doing this experiment or while I'm doing this experiment <laughs> and if you are doing this experiment let me know give me some feedback leave me some comments down below so I know what's going on with your experiment so today is day seven of my keto diet and I am ready to have my keto morning drink so I'll be back all right I'm back so you know what's in here but I'm going to tell you again just so you remember <laughs> 12 ounces of hot or warm water that I microwave and I put the coconut oil fair first which is half a tablespoon then I added the teaspoon of organic ginger root powder and last I added the two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar that's what's in my morning drink 
All right, I'm gonna go sip this while I'm prepping for my breakfast. So by the time I finish this, I'm ready to cook my breakfast. Then I'm gonna show you and eat my breakfast. All right, it is almost 12 o'clock right now and I am just having my breakfast. <laughs> That's what I do on my day off, you guys. So I have here two bacon and I use the oil of the bacon to, um, I, to do my eggs over easy. I have two eggs over easy there and about three quarters of a cup of broccoli. I just uh, use the same oil from the bacon for the broccoli. You just kind of saute it a little bit there. And then I'll show you what I'm gonna have for dessert. All right, yes, I'm having dessert on my breakfast. Look how pretty that is. All right, you guys, do you wanna see what I'm having for dessert? That's right, this is mocha. Uh, it's not really a latte. It's mocha drink. <laughs> so I just kind of invented it today. <laughs> I uh, have here a cup of freshly brewed coffee. I add um, two tablespoons of pasture raised heavy whipping cream. Mm -hmm. Then I added half a serving of my organic cacao. And I topped it off with some of the cinnamon, ground cinnamon that I have, and a little bit of cayenne pepper. And secret ingredient here, I put a little, little bit of Himalayan pink salt. So let's see how it tastes like. You can give it a good stir. very hot so I'm just gonna go from here oh boy yeah it is so good so good <laughs> oh yeah I, the, on this one, I could definitely use a drop or a couple of drops of stevia. So I think I'm going to invest on stevia. As soon as I can get back to Portsmouth Health Food, I'm gonna grab me one of those stevia. That you, that's, I think it's like in a dropper. So I think two, one max of two drops for me will be perfect. Give these guys a try and let me know how it is, how you like it. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. Hi, you guys, I am back. It is 2.40 p.m. and we are still on December 14th. I am gonna have a little bit of snack. I know, huh? It's carbs. Uh, this is uh, about three ounces of raspberries, so I already had some of it. And I'm gonna have this. And then I'm gonna hop in to my Nordic track. Uh, probably gonna do an endurance training, maybe about an hour at least to, um, I don't know, it depends on the movie that I'm watching. So an hour to an hour and a half. So I need a little bit of carbs to help me with that. And I'm gonna get started and I'll talk to you in a little bit. Just wanted to put it out there. This is actually not part of the program for the keto diet um, that I got from Thomas Delauer, but I wanted to give this a try because I want to customize it to my, you know, I want to customize the program to my own um, experiment. And I wanted to see how is this going to pan out. It's not too much. It's three ounces. I know it's fruits and it's not part of a keto diet, but I love fruits and I really want to enjoy this experiment and I want to see how is this going to affect the program. All right, I will let you know, you guys. So we'll find out tomorrow or the next day. <laughs> but for now, I'm going to go finish this, watch the movies, hop on to my 
no detract elliptical slash step slash so much fun equipment all right you guys i'll talk to you soon hashtag awesome hashtag awesome and it is 3 30 p.m right now and of course you can't have raspberries without a follow-up of my new obsession right here two tablespoons of organic sour cream really good you guys i got it from portsmouth health food i'm gonna have this i am watching filipino movies right now still haven't hop into my nordic track but i got my um cordless earbuds here so i'm gonna go eat this drink tons of water and hop into my nordic track for real this time all right <laughs> cheers all right that was an hour and i'm done movie's still on it's a really good movie it's 5 55 p.m right now and we're still on december 14th and just having a little snack here i'm still finishing up this filipino movie that i'm watching it's called manga mungun ting lihim really good movie with uh, Judy Ann Santos, Agut Isidro, and the other actress. I really don't know her. Uh, Janice de Belen is here too. And it's a really good movie. I'm almost done. So I'm going to go eat this snack. Um, this is uh, one of the adobos that I made last night. And actually two nights ago. And I have one for me. Uh, no veggies right now. I'm just having a snack. My daughter invited me to go have dinner with, with them at their apartment, so I'm saving my macros for later. So I just finished watching the movie, and uh, now I'm going to have an ounce of uh, organic mozzarella cheese. So it's 7 o'clock p.m. now, and I'm just having half a tablespoon of coconut oil. Yes, I'm eating it straight from the bottle. All right, this is what we're going to start with. A little Cabernet Sauvignon appetizer. Having this small crab cake, piece of that mm. claw, and a little bit of mayonnaise with sriracha. All right, this is what's for dinner. So about, I don't know how many cup of that and uh, broccoli. About a cup, maybe not even, right? About a cup. About a cup of uh, baby broccoli, it's broccolini, and four ounces of salmon, cooked in olive oil. There you go. What you having, baby? Um, what do you call that fish? Haddock, I think. Haddock? Breaded haddock? Yes, breaded haddock. Cool. Broccoli and potato. Cool. What you having, Dre? Potatoes. <laughs> Potatoes. <laughs> and I'm having, maybe, what is this? Like an ounce of Cabernet Sauvignon. Mm, Cheers. Potatoes. Potatoes. Yeah. That looks good, you guys. Thanks for inviting me. Mm. 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 <laughs> Thanks for cooking the broccoli. Mm. Oh, you're welcome. Thanks for cooking the fish, Andre. Mm. <laughs> good job on this. Perfect. On? Mm -hmm. It's perfect. Mm. All right, I'm gonna give this dessert a try. I'm not supposed to have this, but she's forcing me to eat it. Mm. <laughs> she has no idea. <laughs> oh gosh, she's forcing me to eat Don't this. Look at me. All right, Talenti. Oh, talented. Is that what it means? I guess. Mm -hmm. It's hazelnut chocolate chip gelato. It's the best gelato in it's the world. It's the best gelato. She it said. tastes like the one I had in Spain. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Where'd you get this? Hannaford. <laughs> oh, really? Not in Spain? <laughs> Not in Spain. Oh, man. I was going to try it if it's from Spain, but I'll try it either way. So, what is this? Like an ounce? Hopefully, I'm not allergic to hazelnut. You know the deal with my allergy, you guys, so here, cheers. This is not definitely a keto diet, but that's all right. I run for one, one hour today. I mean, not run. Um, Lordy track for one hour today. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I eat like Get almost that away from me. I told you. 
I was like, I don't, I begged him to go get it. <laughs> this is not good. She sat over there on the floor in, in a ball until I went to Hannaford's to get her some. No, I didn't. Yeah, you did. Don't look in the camera and say that you didn't. I didn't. Like, what did you do? Fingers are crossed. <laughs> what did you do? Tell me again. What did you do? She sat on the floor on a ball. On the floor? Like, looking like she was going to cry, and she told me I had to go get some of that. Oh my gosh. No, that's false. I know this is good, you guys. Okay, get that. Get that away from me. Can't have that. Thank you for letting me try it. So good. I knew you would like it. It's like, really is the best. Creamy. Mm. I don't know if I can have nuts though, so that's, that should be enough for me. Mm. Alright you guys, that's it for dinner. I have dessert. And... I can't really drink this, so I'm gonna give this back to them. I I only had like a couple of sips. Here, baby girl. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you in a little bit. Alright, having a little snack, it's cheese heads, cheese sticks. Alright you guys, we're done chilling here. We're food fog and I want more of those hazelnut though. I love it. But I think I'm probably allergic to it. Mildly. Don't you think so? I got a little dizzy but it's okay. it didn't close though. So it's good. Alright baby girl, good she. Love you. Bye, baby boy. <laughs> Where are you? What are you drinking? <laughs> you got a problem. <laughs> Is that a real deal? Good night, everybody. <laughs> Why do I have a flask? <laughs> do you put that in your pocket? <laughs> oh, that's a display thing. Let me see. That's a nice thing, you guys. You got it from a bar. See, we... To carry this from the parking, well, no, from her car up to here, it's like 500 pounds. <laughs> no, it's actually very light. I'm surprised you guys didn't carry it on your own. It's so light. Well, we got up, but you were coming tonight. Ah, <laughs> uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> you wanted me to work out, huh? All right, just an update for my macros for this uh, day seven. My goal for fat. Is 125 and I hit 122 grams my goal for carbohydrates is 20 and I went over I hit 39 grams and my goal for protein is 74 grams and I hit 80 grams so I went over on my protein on my carbohydrates especially carbohydrates I want eight uh, 19 grams that's a lot for today so we'll see how is that gonna pan out but I also work out for an hour today on Nordic Trek, so I'm not too worried about exceeding a little bit of the carbohydrates. I'm fine with that. Day seven is done. Maraming salamat po. Cheers. This is my look, my life, my love. This is my destiny.